To set up your new CCST388, start by backing out the scale travel pin. Remove the lower back cover and find the 10 millimeter locking nut in the center and behind the oil discharge and new oil bottles. Use a 10 millimeter wrench to unlock the nut and then back the 10 millimeter bolt out about 7 to 8 full turns. Leave the pen in place to be reinserted in case the unit needs to be transported or rolled over very rough surfaces. Next, connect the high and low side service couplings to the service hoses. Red on red, blue on the blue hose, and connect to the appropriate port on the front of the machine. The vacuum pump oil level can be checked by arrowing to assisted procedure, then vacuum. The taps can be closed during this test. Press start and observe the vacuum pump oil level. It should be at or just above the oil level line. Our next step of setup is to fill the internal bottle with R134A. Locate and install the virgin tank adapter that is supplied with your machine onto the Virgin R134A tank. Connect the high side coupler to the adapter. Now arrow down to Next Menu and press Enter. Arrow to Bottle Filling and press Enter. Please note if your CCST388 has no bottle filling option, Use Assisted Procedure and Recovery Recycling to transfer refrigerant. In the Bottle Filling menu, enter the amount of refrigerant you want to transfer and press Start. The display will tell you to open the high side machine tap, the high side service coupling, and the tank valve. Invert the tank if access to liquid is tank inverted and press start. The unit will recover the specified amount of R134A and alarm when it needs you to close the tank valve and service coupling. To fill the oil bottle, remove the new oil bottle from the oil scale. Open the cap and add oil. Replace the oil bottle to the oil scale. When using PAG oil, add oil just before vehicle service. You are now ready to use your CCST 388.